everyone, this is Kelsey Baker, and I am going to be sharing information on firewalls. This presentation is for David Mann, Tyler Nelson, Travis Longacre, and myself. In this presentation, we will be covering what a firewall is and what the best firewalls to install and use on your system. Firewalls reside, in essence, between your network and internet. They provide a protective barrier, preventing attacks coming from the outside. Firewalls monitor your system's communications and help detect and prevent intrusions, as well as assist in controlling the activities of internet applications. Firewalls tend to be the most frustrating freeware products to use. To find a suitable firewall, a user should look for a firewall that is not too intrusive or complicated. There are two types of firewalls, software and hardware. Software-based firewalls run on your laptop or computer in the background, while hardware firewalls are typically found in broadband routers. Hardware firewalls use packet filtering by examining a packet's header to determine its source and location. The best protection for your computer or laptop is to use both types, since they each offer different security features that are highly needed. The main feature of this presentation, we will be covering the open source firewall IP tables. Travis is going to demonstrate how to download this Linux-based firewall and its features. So in the first half of this video, we talked about firewalls and what they are. Now in the second half, we are going to talk about open source and how to install an open source firewall. Open source is just access to the source code of a program or software. Uh, people who put, like Linux, put open source operating system out there so people can go in and add software, tweak software, make security patches. Pretty much you're able to change the code of the software and do what you like with it. So we are going to download IP tables as our firewall. So you just type IP tables download. You can click the newest patch that they have out that's fixed some bugs. And then you just click there to download it, which I have already. And then you're going to need to log in as your root user. And once you're logged in, you're going to want to install it. So you're just going to type install. And then since I have already installed it, it says it has nothing to do since it has already been installed. Then you're going to want to create a folder to store the rules that you will be able to, con to change. To help better protect your computer and then you're going to want to start I, the IP table so you type out that command it's going to start up it doesn't look like it's done anything so to demonstrate that it has start you're just going to type IP tables and then give it a command so we're going to list all the rules or definitions that have been which none have so everything is open right now so you see it's been installed and now it is running so if you'd like to go in and add um, definitions or I guess they call it rules you're able to go in and do that um, so yeah well thank you for watching